Well, I don't know about you, but I'm, thank goodness it's Friday. Anytime there's any type of system that poses any type of tropical threat at all to South Florida, it's a stressful time. So I am glad this is starting to pass now to the east of us so we don't have to worry about it anymore. And I wasn't really worried about it, but you never say never as you're watching one of these systems come very, very close to you, even if it's a little bit ahead of hurricane season. Here's the radar tonight. You can see this kind of ball of kind of a raggedy ball of showers and thunderstorms just off our coast now and gradually lifting to the north. That's the low pressure area that is slowly moving towards the northwest Bahamas there. And as it does, it's going to pull the heaviest rain away with it. In fact, pretty good lightning show out there right now, but most of the rain is gradually decreasing. The flash flood warning in Miami-Dade has now been canceled. Still a flood advisory until just after midnight. And do a few showers around still. We'll see some showers also on the beaches and maybe just some brief, tiny areas of street flooding. But other than that, uh, things gradually improve as we go through the night. There's Broward. You can see also some showers moving through. We're going to see showers off and on through the night tonight, but the heavy, heavy activity is pretty much done or at least winding down. This is rainfall estimates from the radar earlier today. These orange areas here are greater than four inch amounts. Two big bullseyes, one in Broward, one in northern Miami-Dade. Some individual amounts uh, better than five and even close to six inches in a few spots. So uh, a lot of rain. We needed the rain, but uh, we got a lot of it uh, during the last 12 hours. Here's the rain forecast, and you can see just about all of it is offshore. All of it is east of us. Still maybe a few little spotty areas of a half inch or more right along coastal locations. But the flood potential is decreasing. The rainfall potential is decreasing. Current temperatures are mainly in the 70s right now across South Florida. The breeze beginning to turn more north and northwesterly now. That's around the back side of the low pressure area that's off to our east so that's a good sign as well peak wind gusts earlier today were up in the 20 to 30 mile an hour range in the heavier showers there's the tropical moisture pulling away here we are 24 hours from now with probably what is going to be a developing tropical or subtropical system now moving to the north we are looking pretty good here in south florida after that the folks on the north carolina coast will be watching closely there's the monday evening time frame there for that system our forecast for tonight. Still some passing showers with things winding down. Maybe a brief downpour a low near 74. Tomorrow the sun comes out. Temperatures warm up. May see a few spotty afternoon storms. Shouldn't be too big of a deal. High temperature near 88 degrees. On the water winds settling down some west to southwest at 15. Seas running 2 to 4 feet and taking us through the weekend into next week. We're going to flip the switch. Go into a summery pattern here with mainly afternoon thunderstorms. Weekend in the upcoming week. CBS 4 News Nights coming right back.